Hello guys, good evening and welcome to RC Overdose. And this evening we are painting out the bodies here. I painted one of the bodies in the past, the Ferrari Red, for the Stampede uh, two-wheel drive Ford Raptor SVT 150 body, the F-150. And I like that. So I had another one of those right here. And this thing is cut from all the sides and everything and all the decals are in there. The body has been washed from inside before painting it on. There is a protective film on the top as it says here. So after you paint you can peel that off and you will see a lot of glossiness in the outside plastic part which is really good. And I like that about the JP, I'm sorry the J Concepts people. This is the guys that I bought it from. And it's supposed to come with all this stuff. It says $30 here. But keep in mind I bought it for $38 and with shipping it costs about 50, $52 Canadian which is okay you know $52 body then you buy like a $15 spray paint for it and you use that so, <laughs> so this is a spray paint that I'm going to be using right now it's called the uh, Rosolium Painter Stage Ultra Cover 2X uh, I'm reading French I'm sorry guys <laughs> okay so that also bonds in plastic which is awesome fast drying ideal for indoor and outdoor wood metal wicker and more gloss black so we'll see how that turns out guys and i hope you enjoy the video this is what i did in the video before this one so i hope you enjoy that as well and we'll see the outcome of that tomorrow i'm i can't wait honestly i really love it and i just love the color red <laughs> So there you go guys, I'm going to be painting this body right here, right in front of you. And if you enjoy my video, please subscribe to my channel and leave a like. Thanks a lot for watching our series. Here we go. So I've seen a few YouTubers before, painting and everything, and I really like, I took a lot of lessons from them, I took a few notes, you know. Well, you're supposed to use a mask, because this color is very, very bad if it goes in your lungs, but... I don't have a mask, so whatever. I'll do like that. <laughs> Just kidding. All right, guys. So let's get down to this. There we go. So you gotta go easy like that. You don't want to stay at one place, cause that'll collect a lot and it's it's not nice. So here you go, guys. The very first time. Let's hope for the best. You know, we might want to bring it a little bit far from this thing, but hold up, let me just, sorry about this guys. I'm going to have to move these things a little bit far because all the spray is like going right on it and probably would damage and I don't want that. <laughs> As you already know, and I'll change the location here a little bit. So that's gloss black, so it should be nice and metallic looking. But we'll see how it is tomorrow. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cover the first part here, and then we'll let it dry for a little bit. Before we do another coating. So this was the first coating, and you definitely, I don't want to smell that a lot. I'm gonna open the door here. My mom, she's a medical lab technician and she, so she works in a hospital. So she was actually supposed to bring a mask for me today but it was like rushy and she forgot. It's okay. <sighs> okay, I can finally breathe. So that was just a little paint job here for you guys. I really wanted to do it last time also but last time I did it really fast and I was just so excited so this time I was I, I, I was sure that I was going to record it for you guys. And so the first time you ever do this, you just want to make sure that 
You go easy and slow like that. You don't you don't stop at one place because that's gonna collect paint and you know heaps of paint. You don't you don't you want that. And also when you are using a spray paint bottle like that, you also want to make sure that you do get a mask like compulsory no matter what. Don't try this without a mask because you know everybody is different. It might didn't affect me right now too much, but it might you know some it might affect somebody else. So just saying. So take care, guys. And I'll be back with the update for tomorrow with that body, and I'll put some stickers on, and we'll see how that works out. And also, I'm gonna put my Luxon in one piece, and we'll see how that turns out. Also, all the parts are nicely red and shining, and I don't know how it's gonna look. As I said, it must be. I don't know. I don't want to talk about it. We'll see how it looks. So thanks a lot for watching RC Overdose, guys, and stay fresh. Cheers.